Brad Scott spent his career in the logistics industry in Queensland. Now he's six months in to transforming plastic into household goods. So really I just taught myself the world, taught myself how to uh, build these machines and once we got it up it's trial and error. His small scale recycling workshop also serves as a collection point. Robe residents have made negotiating the six bins for different types of plastic a regular pilgrimage. Well I have my, my plastic bags all numbered and as I, they all fill up I bring them around and put them into the bins here. That plastic is being chopped up and melted down into doorknobs, cheese boards and bowls. Farmers also deposit agricultural waste. This has been a great learning experience for me, uh, coming from the uh, age group I am, um, where rubbish was just rubbish, but now it's uh, becoming more important. They only have to come in the first time and, and ask and get their head around it, and then everything, every other time they come in, they know then where their plastics go, so it really is, is, is creating a habit and, and getting that knowledge. And businesses are looking at opportunities to recycle. We get lots of oil drums which are made out of plastic and the plastic we usually just take to the waste depot. Adelaide-based charity Aussie Bread Tags send 50 kilos of tags collected from all over the country. Almost 2,000 go into each bowl. What surprised me is the uptake. Um, I actually think the community has come on board quicker than I expected. Um, my figures are better than I budgeted for. An idea and transformation, both physical and cultural, that's been embraced by this community.